Hi guys, welcome back. This is Mike Hermes with another Maya uh, modeling tutorial. And today I want to show you guys how you can create a, a spoke a spoked wheel uh, pretty fast. All right, let's get started. So we're going to start by creating a cylinder. And we're going to make that nice and thin. Something like that. Stretch it out a bit. A bit more. Okay, maybe something like that. We're going to hit E to rotate it. Make sure you rotate it at 90 degrees. So we're going to our attribute editor, minus 90, like that. And now we're going to position it on our grid. And make sure that it's on the grid exactly, like that like that. We'll just zoom in to make sure that we're centered like that. Okay, looks good. And we need to move it out a little bit so that's aligned as well. And we'll zoom in there a bit. Okay, like that. So the spoke is pointing towards the center of the grid like so. Now what we're going to do is we're going to select that spoke, we're going to go to Edit, Duplicate Special, and we're going to hit the Option box. Alright, now what we're going to do here, make sure that you got Copy selected. Actually, I'll just quickly reset that. Okay, make sure you got Copy selected. Parent, that's fine. We're going to rotate the spokes uh, on this axis here, and we're going to rotate it by 30 degrees per copy. And in total, we want uh, 12, and we already got one. So we want an additional 11. 12 times 30 is 360, so that should be one uh, circle. Okay. Hit Duplicate Special. There you go. All right. Now next is we're going to create a wheel around that. So we're going to go with a polygon pipe. Gonna drag that out like so. Pull it up a little bit. And in our attribute editor, so we're gonna go to object mode, okay. We're gonna make sure that we have enough um, divisions to make it nice and smooth. So we're gonna bump that up to 60. That looks better. And then we're gonna go to our um, top view. And we're gonna move that up. Hit F to zoom in. Something like that. Something like so. We can R to scale that out. Just to make sure that all the spokes are in contact, like that. We're going to just uh, check it from our side view to make sure that our spokes are centered out in the middle. So we're going to hit W and we're going to push the wheel down a little bit so that's in the center, like that. And I'm going to hit 5 for shaded mode. Okay, and now what we're going to do is we're going to right click on the wheel, go to edge. We're going to click and double click that edge, click, double click that edge. And what we're going to do is we're going to go to Edit Mesh, Bevel, so we get a little bit more shape there. And then on the outside of the uh, wheel, we're going to do a similar thing. We're going to click Edge, double click, Edge, double click. We're going to go to Edit Mesh, Bevel again, like that. So it's looking pretty round. Now we're going to create a little cap in the middle here. So let's make that a cylinder. We're going to pull that up. And we're going to move that to the center. Use our top view for that. Hit F to zoom in. We're going to move something like that. Actually, it's pretty smooth in the middle. 
in your attribute editor we're going to make sure we got enough uh, uh, divisions so it's nice and round bump that up to 60 we're going to check our side view we're going to pull that down let's see if that is yeah, it's not too bad maybe down a little bit more I'm just going to check it in our perspective view how that looks all right now what we're going to do is we're going to take those edges again go to edge we're going to click double click for that edge click double click for that edge edit mesh bevel and we're going to give a little bit more body to that so we're going to increase the segments no, not too much something like that and we're going to right click on this go to ed object mode click on it and we're going to hit R and we're going to scale that down something like that so there you go a very quick and easy spoke wheel uh, hope you like it if you've got any questions let me know thank you